Good day. Today we're going to be uh, installing the camera module on the Raspberry Pi. So that way next week we can actually get the ultrasonic sensor working with the camera module. Um, but with that being said, let's have a look at the Raspberry Pi and uh, we'll go ahead and explain what we need to do to get started. Okay, so we have our Raspberry Pi here. Uh, so the first thing we want to look at here is getting our ribbon connected here. Now, you want to make sure that you connect it correctly. Uh, there should be a blue tab on this side here. Um, basically, if it doesn't work, chances are you have either the ribbon here or the ribbon on your camera module set up incorrectly. So I'm just going to bring the other camera over for a moment here. As you can see, I have my ribbon cable right here set up. So the blue is basically facing my Ethernet port there. And then I have it connected to my Raspberry Pi module here. Now, with the module right here, uh, I'm just waiting for the autofocus to kick in. There we go. So with the module here, um, we you can see that basically mine is pretty chewed up. Uh, I've tested my camera module. It's not working up to its fullest potential. So I'm going to have to order a new camera for it, which should be here by Wednesday. So I should have lots of time to get next week's video ready for you. So this is just from overuse and abuse. Uh, anyways... So this is how you're going to want your camera module set up. Another thing I got coming I just thought I'd mention is uh, right now I'm not happy with the temperature of uh, the Raspberry Pi being so open aired like this. It's not cooling. I've had it up to 80 degrees Celsius and uh, that's a little too warm for me when my best machine doesn't even see over you know 30 or 40 at the highest point so with that being said we'll head over to the raspberry pi and we'll continue to set up our camera uh, so that way next week we can get programming that ultrasonic sensor alongside our raspberry pi camera so let's go ahead and do that now all right so we've got a raspberry pi here and the first thing we want to do is click on the Pi icon here and we're going to go to Preferences and then Raspberry Pi Configuration. And what we want to do is go to the Interfaces tab here and just make sure our camera is enabled. So I already have mine enabled. If yours is showing disabled, go ahead and click on Enable and then click OK. Now I do recommend that once you do this that you basically hit reboot. Um, and then we can test after we reboot by we can type this into our terminal and it will give us a snapshot. On our desktop. So once we do that we should be able to go down here and load it up and there we go as you can see uh, my camera's not the greatest right now and this is why I'm gonna be updating it so that's gonna do it for the setup aspect of it which next week like I said we will be incorporating the camera into the ultrasonic and playing around with that and maybe we'll play around with that for a few weeks we'll come up with a cool little uh, a GUI system for it or something like that and that way we can log um, do multiple things from using it as a motion sensor to yeah a bunch of different things we can do um, if you have any ideas of what you'd like to see done with the two modules put together let me know in the comments section below so with that being said thanks for watching everyone you have a wonderful day a wonderful week and we'll see you next time take care eh?